I'm gonna smack you with my balls. Pretties, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Tanya and I film all kinds of pink, girly, beauty, fashion, and lifestyle videos on this channel. If that's something you're into, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and push bell notifications so you don't miss any of my videos. So for today's video, I want to do a Valentine's Day girly haul. So this is not going to be Valentine's Day decorations or anything like that. If you guys are not aware, I'm in the process of moving, but I did get a bunch of cute girly things that are kind of valentine's day themed some of these things are for my wedding and other things are like they're just cute and pink and i feel like they would make good valentine's gifts but pretty much this is just a collective haul of everything i have for like the past you know since the last girly haul however um i will be doing a separate victoria's secret haul which will be up after this video let's go ahead and get started the first thing i want to share with you guys is my gorgeous new flower box so these are real preserved roses from rose forever let me just show you guys this box is absolutely stunning this is a marble square box and it has all of these roses in it and i'm oh, it's just gorgeous these are just going to be so beautiful in our home i'm just so excited to use these to decorate and they're just super pretty perfect shade of pink you guys know how much i love this like very neutral baby pink color it's just so so pretty so i do want to mention for those of you interested in rose forever to maybe gift it to somebody even if you want to get this for yourself as a valentine's day gift i'm just here to tell you you deserve something nice for valentine's day okay so if you want to get yourself one of these are totally worth it in my opinion they smell delicious i do want to mention to you guys that rose forever is having a huge valentine's day sale but on top of that i am going to be giving you guys a 25 dollar discount code which will be overlaid right here so you can get 25 dollars off of anything on the rose forever website want to mention real quick all the materials they use for the boxes are vegan even the pink suede and black velvet boxes they do have like a really huge range of colors so if you don't want pink they do have a ton of other colors so everything for the valentine's day sale will be in the description box but yeah this is the first thing i got for valentine's day i felt it was appropriate to mention it first because it's like the most valentine's day thing in this haul aside from my nails actually i guess i i'm gonna put this back here i guess i can show you guys my valentine's day nails as part of the haul i got my nails done in mexico and i got a valentine's theme and i just thought that they're so pretty she did such a good job i'm a little shaky because i'm all caffeinated right now we have so many things that i'm doing at one time i'm packing i'm filming and i'm doing schoolwork so you know we had a cup of coffee or two so don't mind me if i'm like super hyper because that's how i get but okay continuing on i do have some pr i have some things i purchased myself obviously and then I have some wedding things. So I guess we can start with the wedding thing since that would be the next most appropriate thing. I got my wedding shoes. Seriously, can we not? Yes, these are my wedding shoes. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm so in love with them. I just, I can't, I want to cry just looking at them. And I did get the chunky heel because we want to be comfortable. Like my dress is long so you can... I mean, the shoes are really for, like, pictures, you know what I mean? But, you know, you can hardly see them throughout the day because they're, like, under the dress. But, you know, we got something comfortable because I did debate whether getting, like, the skinnier heel or the chunkier heel. I think the skinnier heel looked more wedding, but, girl, it's all about comfort for this girl. So <laughs> I definitely got the chunky heel so we can be comfortable. I have yet to break them in. They're, like, brand new. So I'm just... I'm over the moon. These are like my dream wedding shoes. We're not going to get into it because I'll sit here and talk to you guys for like five whole minutes about shoes. So, okay, the next thing I got for my wedding is the dress for our engagement photos. So, we have not taken engagement photos. Like, we took photos when he proposed, but we don't have like official engagement photos yet. And I got this gorgeous dress. So, it came from Opali. So, I wanted to show you guys the box. It's really pink and pretty. And this is a dress. I'm not gonna try it on because like I don't want to like get it dirty or anything like at all until the day I'm gonna wear it. And it's just, it's so stunning. It's a beautiful ivory color. The sleeves are like beaded pearls and they have like a little bit of a bell to them. 
and I'm just oh my goodness this is amazing so this is so cute and I was wondering what you guys think oh by the way it's like a maxi dress with a slit I was wondering what you guys think maybe you can give me your opinion in the comment section I really need y'all's help so I kind of want to wear my wedding shoes for the engagement photos since like in the wedding pictures you can't really see the shoes like is that bad luck or is that like bad that I want to do that should I like get a different pair of shoes for the engagement photos my cat's are having a cat fight <laughs> my cats are going crazy because they literally have like two rooms to be in and like that's like not enough space for them i guess because they're bougie so yeah they argue and fight a lot lately and i don't know what is going on but i tried like making them separate bowls of food they have separate litter boxes i just don't know what's wrong with them i think they just know like they're not really home so like anyway so anyway what i was talking about is should I wear the shoes for the engagement photos? Because they just match so perfectly with the dress. I want to wear them so bad for the engagement photos. Let me know what you think down below. I forgot to show you guys. I got my maid of honors. I have two maid of honors. I got them both a silk robe. And then I got all my bridesmaids pink versions of this with gold lettering instead of black. And there says bridesmaid on it. And then you guys have seen my bride one in that Victoria's Secret haul that you guys saw a while back. So I have a PR box. This is from Blinged Brushes. They did come out with a new brush set with Miss Paige Corin. And it's so... I just gotta show you guys this packaging, how it arrived. It's so cute. I do have a coupon code for Blinged Brushes as well. Which I believe is just my name, but I'll overlay it right here. They put little chocolate and like a chocolate... This is so Valentine's and so cute. So I thought I would show you guys this next. It did come with this adorable blinged makeup bag, which I will be using. And we have the gorgeous brush set. So let me open it. It's different for them because most of their brushes are like rhinestone bling, but these are like glitter bling. So they are still very on brand. It's still bling. And I mean, I love that there's like a fan brush that's really cute. So I'm just going to show you guys a couple of them close up. And I will link them below so you guys can check them out on the website. But they're really, really pretty. Very pink, very girly, and very glittery. It reminds me like Barbie. It's like very, very Barbie. And then the handle is like a champagne, like rose. I don't know. It's like a light rose gold or like a champagne gold. I don't know. Really pretty though. That was all of the really Valentine's Day themed items I have. Could be wrong, but yeah. So next I have some girly mail that I got from my friend Evita. She is another YouTuber and Instagrammer. I'm going to link her stuff down below. Um, This is not... Well, some of it's Valentine's because it's like self-care things, but... Okay, so I was looking for these like mugs forever and she found them and she sent them to me. She sent them to me for my birthday, but I just aren't my mail has been a little bit crazy. Like, um, I believe I gave her my old address and so my tenants, we have tenants living in that house now, they had this box and um, I finally got it from them because um, I needed to go pick it up obviously but yeah she did put a lot of really nice goodies. Some of this stuff is Christmas themed, some of it's Halloween themed. Speaking of, do you guys still want me to do a what I got for Christmas? I kind of still want to do that. Let me know. Anyway these are the mugs. They're pink jack-o-lantern mugs and there's two of them and can I just say, like, it was so sweet of her to go out of her way to get me a pair of these and send them to me. These were so hard to find. Like, I looked for them for months and they were going really expensive on, like, Mercari and I just could not justify it for a mug. So, um, when she knew I was looking for them, she actually gifted them to me for my birthday, which was so sweet of her. Thank you so much, Evita. Um, Evita is one of those girls that I've just been friends with for like years and years since like 2012 I think or 2013 or 14 I don't know it's been a long time we followed each other forever already and she's just the sweetest thing on earth and she makes really cute organizing videos she has the most stocked up beauty room I've ever seen she has like every product I just want to go in there and like use her room as like a shopping spree because she has like everything but yeah I'm going to link her Instagram and her YouTube down below you guys make sure to go check her out and tell her thank you for me for getting these for me i know this is not very valentine's day but i did want to give her a little shout out and then she did send me some goodies that i guess could be considered like valentine's themed so let me show you guys me all of these adorable 
Hello Kitty face masks. Um, there's this one. This one's more like Christmas themed. And then she sent me this creme shop one, which is also Christmas themed. And then she sent me a Winter Wonderland face mask set, which has little, like, what do you call these? Like nutcrackers and like, you know. It reminds me of Clara and the Nutcracker. It's like, and these are very cute. Like, look at the little pouches. The pouches are adorable. I know we're not on Christmas anymore. It took me so long to actually open this box. I'm so sorry, Evita. It's taken me this long, but girl, this movie has been crazy. So she also sent me this adorable eye candy eyeshadow palette by Nicole Miller. This is very pretty. Like, I don't think I ever saw this in store. Let me get it open. Oh, it, it actually opens like this. Okay, so I'm going to leave it in the packaging because I'm moving right now and I'd rather it have the plastic around it just in case anything, you know. But yeah, very, very pretty. Love me some neutrals. She also sent this like really pretty pink nail set. And she sent me a ColourPop Looks Cream Looks Lipstick. She knows I love brown and like nude lip colors, so I'm guessing that's what this is. Yes, she knows I love my poop colors. <laughs> Will forever love my poop colors, so yeah. Thank you so much, Evita. Honestly, girl, you did not have to. This is so sweet. Really, really appreciate everything, so thank you so much. Oh yeah, I forgot. She also sent these slippers. So, you know, she knows me. I love slippers. So, yeah, look how cute these are. They're like a pink leopard print. Definitely very up my alley. And I actually decluttered a bunch of slippers when I was packing. So, it's nice to have a pair to restock my little slipper basket. Okay, speaking of self-care items, I picked this up from CVS because I tend to do my own nails a lot. Just where I live, I don't really have like a nail tech. I've never found anyone that I really love. So um, yeah, I have a, I got this little nail filer thing. It's like an electric one, which is really nice. So you can find this at CVS if you would like it. And uh, yeah, right now I have my nails done because I got them done in Mexico. But like once these are gone, I'll probably be back to doing my own nails. We will see. Okay, so I picked up things from Fashion Nova, which is really random. I don't shop there too much, but I ordered one thing. I think it was a New Year's dress, and they sent me all these, like, $10 off coupons. So I ordered some things from Fashion Nova. So the first thing is this adorable little top. I thought the, all these things were kind of Valentine's Day themed. I feel like they could be, you know, very Valentine's Day. So this one says blessed and it's kind of see-through so I would probably wear pasties or like wear a lace bralette underneath it and it's a little crop top. I just thought this would be very cute. I've been really into like the Y2K fashion. Like I'm not super Y2K. I still love like my classic fashion like the tweed and like you know the the pussy bow ties and I love my lazy fashion. This girl loves comfort so yeah I still love all my Victoria's Secret pink lounge. I love loungewear and I love Y2K and I love like classy classic fashion so yeah that's kind of like my aesthetic I guess. I don't know I feel like I'm all over the place with my fashion to be honest but I like it that way. So I also got this adorable top when I tell you guys this makes the girls look so good. It makes the girls look so good like yeah, we have to try to wear this sometime this month because it's very Valentine's theme. You could use this as lingerie, but I feel like it's more like a shirt, you know? Yeah, it's very cute with the lace detailing. And this feels amazing, amazing quality. It even has like the tie thing in the back, so it's like very secure. So yeah, I really love this. If, if these items are available, I will link them below. So I also got a little purse from Fashion Nova and I mean I just could not not get this. It's like a little baby Birkin but it, obviously it's not Birkin because it's from Fashion Nova. But it's like fuzzy and cute. I have this thing about fuzzy purses. I just really like fuzzy things. I like fuzzy sparkles and pink. So comfy sparkly things are my favorite. I actually have not worn this or anything. It's a brand new so... Um, yeah, I just thought it's very cute. It has this cute little, like, I don't know, like a little charm. And it actually opens through like this. Like, it's not open on top. Like, you have to... So, yeah, it's kind of like a little Birkin. Let me show you guys. So, there it is. And it does have a crossbody strap. What can you even fit in this? Like, 
a phone. Oh no, actually it looks like it kind of packs a punch and you could just wear it like this without closing it, which I think is like kind of what people do. I don't know, but it's super pink on the inside as well. And I just think this is like a really cute little fashion bag, like for a little tweet outfit or whatever, or even when you're wearing jeans and like a shirt. I think this would be cute, like casually. Okay, I know we were talking about a Fashion Nova purse, but I keep staring at this cute pink chocolate and I just kind of want to eat one. So very Valentine's Day on brand <laughs> eating chocolate in this video, but... Mm, those are so good. Ask your man for them for Valentine's Day. Somebody go send these to Manny in his DMs and be like, this is what Tanya wants for Valentine's Day. Those are delicious. Okay, those taste like a chocolate-covered strawberry, but like with white chocolate. So good. We're talking about my little Fashion Nova purse. Guys, it's so cute. Like, can we not? I love it. It's adorable. Next from Fashion Nova, I got this right here, which is a little, like, winter hat. I feel like I really like my hair today, so I'm not going to try it on. Or should I try it on? I don't know. But I thought this was adorable. It has a little pom-pom. Then it has these strings with little pom-poms. Because I have beanies with little pom-poms like this. But I don't have anything that has a little hanging pom-pom. So I just thought, yeah, we're going to try it on. If I mess up my hair, it, oh well. It's fine. Oh, let me scoop back. That's so cute. I love the little hanging pom-poms. I'm going to smack you with my balls. <laughs> From Fashion Nova, I... <laughs> this was just the pink Fashion Nova haul. I should just do pink, like a whole haul, like a whole pink Fashion Nova haul video eventually, don't you think? I think I should, but I think I found the best stuff on there for this time around though. So we'll see what they have eventually. But yeah, I got these Barbie pink Bratz doll. I don't even know. These are gorgeous. I wore these for my Skims picture, which I will insert right here. And somebody said they loved my shoes, so I was like... Yes, girl, me too. So cute. And then I did get some beauty products. So I restocked on my Milani Rose Elixir. Is that what it's called? Rose Prep and Brighten. I really love this oil. This is my second bottle of it. So I don't, I'm not going to get into it. I do have dry skin, just so you know. Um, but yeah, this is a really nice face oil. It's actually pretty like light it's not like a super oily oil it's like very lightweight yeah it's super lightweight so i feel like even if you're oily you might enjoy this it's very nice and the bottle's gorgeous obviously but i did re-up on that because i don't have any more face oils i use face oils like crazy because of my dry skin and this is the one that's really stood out to me like as a favorite so i repurchased that one that's a barbie palette so they had this on sale um on ColourPop and i've been wanting it for a while so i went ahead and jumped on it when it was on sale i know this is not very new like this has been around for a while i'm shocked that it's still available but this is just like this is just like really pretty it's a very unique color story i don't have a color story like this so yeah i mean i love palettes but at this point in my life i'm not trying to buy too many more palettes unless it's like a unique color story like this so or like something that's collectible you know like this is barbie so yeah i call them collectible but i actually use my things like i don't just collect them i actually do use everything so i don't know it's not really collectible i guess so i also got some products from a small business this is um dream beauty this is my girl raiza raiza i hope i said your name right girl i'm sorry if i'm butchering it because I'm not good at pronouncing things, but she came out with this highlighter, and when I tell you my jaw literally dropped when I saw this, oh my gosh. Okay, so first of all, the packaging is so freaking cute. Look at this iridescent pink, but look at this highlighter, and I did dig my nail through it when I was <laughs> looking at it, but oh my gosh, this is like, I don't think the camera does it justice. This looks like it has diamonds in it, like look at it oh my gosh it's just phenomenal like let me swatch it for you guys like it's just so so pretty and i can see myself like putting this all over my neck area like on a night out or like just it's gonna make me look like edward cullen in the best way possible so we love that got this lip product and this is 
let me show you guys this packaging is so stunning so this is a lipstick or is it a lip gloss hold on let me mm, okay i'm not sure but okay it's like a liquid lipstick and of course this isn't a color that i would wear this looks exactly like what i have on right now <laughs> i love that for me okay so yeah love this so i love the gold you guys know i love things that are very prettily packaged if you want some unique cute very pretty packaged makeup and you want to support a small business definitely check her out okay, we have a couple amazon goodies to show you guys i know y'all love the amazon goodies so i have this yeah i know it's just a white box let's let's open it so i needed some new hooks for my car like to hang my purse so i got these ones so this just like attaches to your like your seat like this and then you can like hang your purse on this so yeah it's very very cute pink like this is a really pretty pink it matches my seats like perfectly so yeah i love that it comes with four of them so i will always have a spot for my purse i had some bedazzled ones and when they would fall off i would just lose them because they were small so hopefully these larger ones won't get lost but we'll see i picked up a brand new laptop cover that looks like this it's a pink cheetah print very different than what i would usually go for to be honest but i thought it was cute and i kind of have an idea with this like i want to put some cute stickers all over it as you guys know i'm like an online college student right now and i also did i tell you guys i didn't sign up for on-campus classes this semester i just did all online um so yeah i use my laptop a lot not only for college but also for my work so i always try to make sure my laptop is that one thing that is like you know put together well because i have to look at it every single day that's how i am when i have to look at something every single day but yeah it does have a little apple cutout logo which i just prefer when it has that because i feel like it just looks better i can see you guys <laughs> what am i doing <sighs> oh, why am i so weird okay so yeah i prefer when it has a little apple cutout logo i just think it's more like aesthetic and bougie so i like it um but yeah does come with the bottom cover and it came with a little keyboard cover as well two amazon finds will be linked down below i have yet to do like another amazon video but i feel like i always only buy like one or two things at a time so i have a brats package and this is the very last thing to show you guys and okay so this is a collaboration with velvet caviar and they came out with brats phone cases can we not so there's this purple one which this one i'm gonna gift to my friend because her favorite color is lavender and she loves brats dolls so if she's watching this she knows who she is so this one's yours girlfriend and then i will be keeping this one because it's just pink and gorgeous and has all the brats on it and then we'll be keeping these two as well so here is the other one i love this one so much because it has like the pink and like all the brats and i don't know it's so pretty and then this one is probably my favorite because it's like more my vibe it's like a old school phone it looks like a blackberry i actually had a blackberry when i was like 16 i bought it myself too so yeah love that love that for me we can turn my iphone into a blackberry because blackberry was legit back then so we also have these velvet caviar grip rings and we have a butterfly which i will be gifting to my friend with her phone case and then i will be keeping the lip one also have some like a it's like a phone charm like so that you can attach it to the i think it attaches to the phone case and then that way you can like Put your phone on your wrist and it says brats and it has beads this is like my childhood do you guys remember the kids to make these things i had a few of those so yeah so cute we also got a mini brats um set i don't know i think this has like mini makeup or something so it looks like this and it comes with the two little little items and let's see what's in there so we have this one first <gasps> we have a mini a mini cameron is that cameron oh it's dylan we have a mini dylan doll 
<laughs> that is so random. He's so tiny. And then, I don't know, there's more in here. What is this? Oh, it's Dylan and like his motorcycle. So weird and not girly, but <laughs> that's kind of cute that they made like mini Bratz dolls, I guess. And I really want some with actual Bratz dolls though. If these were little Bratz dolls, I would be like crying. I mean, Dylan's cute and all, but give me Jade, give me Chloe, give me Sasha, give me all of them. Jasmine, like, I mean, I don't want Dylan. I mean, those are like little mystery boxes, so obviously they didn't know what's in it when they put it in my package. Yeah, I'm gonna hunt for those. Where do they have those, like at Walmart or something? I'm gonna look for them because I really want like the mini Bratz dolls. I would definitely love mini Bratz dolls. It's so cute. All right, guys, that is everything for today's girly haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. My cat's about to knock over the camera. Get away from there. Oh so yeah, I'm going to let you guys go so I can go edit and upload this for you guys today. Really quick, I know those of you who really care always stay till the end. I just want to tell you and inform you guys that right now I'm in the process of a very big move. I'm not going to disclose too much because I will have an update video here pretty soon, but I am making a move and it is different than the move we initially thought. We are moving to another state, so... <laughs> I know this is like it's, it's a lot so just bear with me while I you know move in things like that there's gonna be moving vlogs I'm going to be showing you guys everything very 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 soon I've just as I've gotten older I like to keep a lot to myself until it's like set in stone and for sure I just like to protect my energy I like to protect my blessings because I take that very seriously I'm very grateful for everything that you know god has allowed in my life and i just want to tell you guys i'm not trying to like gatekeep or keep things from you guys that's not it at all i just want to scream on here everything right now but not yet you guys very soon and i promise you guys i i'm dying to tell you guys everything but i have to wait for personal reasons want you guys to know i still love you guys i'm not trying to put less effort into my videos or anything like that just genuinely right now i'm moving and i'm in between a lot of things and so i'm filming what i am able to film at this time you know like there's not very many room tour videos collection videos organizational videos because everything's literally in boxes right now except for what you're seeing in the background right now like this whole room i packed it up like last week like it's all going in boxes i mean i was gonna do some packing videos but then i realized that it's just so much packing in order for me to be able to film everything and pack i would have needed like a lot more time and i just didn't take the time so that's my bad but we will be packing my vanity. That's the one video I do want to do. I always, when every time I say do twice, I'm like, do, do, <laughs> like I'm such a child. But anyway, um, yeah, the vanity, I do want to pack my vanity with you guys because I feel like it would be very interesting to for me to show you guys my like tips and tricks packing a vanity. So I feel like I looked for a lot of tips and tricks when I packed my vanity, which I will be giving credit to those girls in that video, obviously. But yeah, I just, I will be packing my vanity on camera for you guys and showing you guys some tips and tricks, some that I learned on YouTube, some that I learned out of experience removing so much because I've moved a lot in my life. So yeah, I am going to go ahead and let you guys go because now I'm just rambling and I'm very hungry and my family brought me food. So, okay. Love you guys. I will see y'all in the next one. Bye.